truck stop. And we got this nifty little Burton oven to go. Okay, but what's so special about it? We're gonna make enchiladas with it. But what's so special about this compared to our regular lunchbox oven? It's gonna... Okay, what's so cool about this little oven thing is it flips down like that, like you would be opening an oven door at your house, which is really cool. It's like miniature burden. And then it comes with these little, like, tin thingies that you put your stuff in. And you put the lid on it. Yeah, but how many are in there? There's two of them. So are we going to try to see if foilies fit in there? Yeah, 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 yeah. Fold them up. All right, so we took, and those little pans that we use for the other stuff, the ones I've used for the last two years as little enchilada pans, we figured out to get them to fit in here wasn't really that tough. We just folded the edges in, so we're basically recycling them. Um, but, you know, you're talking no foil needed. You know, when we're done, we pull them out and throw them away. And we got the Burton sitting here. It's powered back there, and it's on low. And Sam's gonna take the chicken and do the normal, you know, squeezing the chicken and putting, I guess, the chicken in this bowl here, and uh, go from there. But that's basically it, and that's where we sit. So she's gonna do a little bit here real quick. We don't have to take that. You guys have seen it like a hundred times already. So we'll let her do that, and then we'll go from there. So we'll see you guys in a few seconds after this little break from Cheese and me setting up dinner. Okay, so we're proceeding with the enchiladas and we drained our chicken, like you've all seen us drain our chicken before. Um, and then what we're doing is we're going to add ground cumin, some garlic salt, some Louisa Hanna hot sauce, the hot chili powder, some onion powder, and some cayenne pepper. And um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna base it off of the soft taco dinner kit. They do have enchilada kits that work great, which if you guys know and have been viewers before, we've used these for when I sent Nick on the road by himself. But the store we went to didn't have the enchilada version, so I grabbed this. So that comes with some taco sauce, some seasoning tacos mix stuff, and then, of course, the tortilla shells that we're gonna use today. So. Now how are we just gonna add all the seasonings to taste? Yep, basically. So basically so we'll just go down the line and as always we just do to whatever amount we think we want and go from there because that's what's the fun of cooking when you can't remember what you put into it and one minute you like it, the next you go, oh God, never enough. Right. All right, so we'll see you guys after we add all the seasonings. <laughs> okay, so we've got all our seasonings and the taco sauce that came in that kit and everything, the taco seasoning, all in there mixed up with two cans of chicken. And then we are going to make sure that we spray the pan so they don't stick. A scoop of chicken. Fill them up for however much you want to fill it up. Let's see how this goes. Just roll it and stick it in the pan. And I'll probably try to get two more in there. So now what are you going to do? I'm going to shove the last one in this tray here. Coaxing. Three of them in the little tray. You take the enchilada sauce. Put that on our 
lightly. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, and then we'll set that over there, and I'll make it the other one, and then we will put the ones in. Alrighty. Alright. Hopefully this Perfect. Cheese is melted, meat's left over. Yeah. Looks good, time to eat. Yeah. So my little hooky thing worked. Yes. You know what, we need to patent it. I wanna take that idea. idea is patented by zombie hunter. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> You'll lose it within a week. I'll have to build another one. <laughs> yeah, start charging people five bucks a piece. There you go. So basically, if we just maybe put a little piece of foil down the middle. It might work, yeah. Cool. Oh, but it's bubbling. It's or no, is it uh, just shaking because of the truck? I can't tell. Can it's bubbling a little bit. So this is the Burton stove, mm -hmm. and we just cooked for both of us about an hour and a half. Yeah. Figure hour and a half for two. So whatever in the single takes about four to half hour, 45, figure closer to an hour, hour and a half if you're doing two, because you're kicking up twice as much. Yes. So. And then, yeah, I mean, you can feel it as you can see, I have the towels around it. Time to break out the spoons. Probably. Exactly. Time to Best eat. way to keep where you go through the foil is you eat with spoons, not yep. forks and knives. Yep. That's from years of experience with me and my other one. So, mm -hmm. all right, we're going to go eat dinner. I already know it's going to be good because it's like enchilada type stuff. <laughs> so, you like your new stove? Yes, I do. Thank you. Okay, well, we're going to get out of here. Oh, come on! What the hell?